thank you very much for this and i would say um thank you very much for the, the entire team like you know industry connect is is a very good platform like i mean before i even started with industry connect this year i knew of them like two years ago which was what i was telling kunal at the beginning so it wasn't from the premise of i just saw them on the internet and engaged i had followed them through and that is what i do before i put myself or invest in something i have to like critically think like oh is this going to benefit me so i i, I don't just do things based on the fact that oh i just want to do it or a friend told me about it I, I i could spend like a lot of money on something but i know like in a short period of time i'll make back that money based on the output i'm getting from whatever i invested in so speaking of industry connect is a good investment it's um, a beautiful platform and um realistically it's 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 it, it it's it sharpens your um abilities and i would say this not just for myself but even for my teammates you know so um i had a very good friend and he's still a good friend his name's fernando and he, he i mean he comes from a background of being a dentist you know and at the moment he's so good that most times like even during the program like he motivated me as well like every time i'm i'm feeling very tired or i'm like oh yeah this this tax is crazy i just think fernando is a dentist and i mean i have like an it background and i'm a data analyst like what am i doing and i just go back again and you know start walking and you know it's 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 a beautiful platform to say that like even if you don't have a background the way um both um you're being taught the way it's been simplified i mean the guys teaching are like i mean even yourself you, you're very good at what you do and you guys are experts but it's broken down and simplified into a way that like even if you don't know what it means you will still grab something you could still stand your ground and you know speak in an interview and say yeah this is what this does this is what this is how it works you know so that that's very good and kudos to um justin and to um the entire team um industry connect mvp it's perfect yeah yeah so i would say um the entire program is an is an all-in-one package yeah you know for me talking hasn't been a problem for me you know so <laughs> it's yeah i i i mean growing up i talked to my dad i talked to people that are like older than me and i get to listen and hear the way they speak you know mm. so i actually tried to pick that charisma in terms of like you know speaking to people in a certain way and not just talking but talking brilliantly you yeah. know to engage people in a logical sense so i mean when you open your mouth and talk like okay yeah this this individual has something up here you know so industry connect as well as um mvp i'm just gonna join everything together hmm. i mean the programs with yante like i don't know if i got her name correctly but then you know i had a couple of sessions you know like the way preparing your cv being um out there you know marketing yourself properly on linkedin which is a like a very very key team because like i i i learned i learned this part from her where um a lot of people you know get certifications on linkedin but just post it out there just for post and sake and then you don't reach out to your recruiter or you don't send a message because you're not saying exactly how you're going to use um that certification to um boost your knowledge in your present workplace you know so it's just like a, a previous um uh certification i just finished uh, design thinking ibm and you know how i clearly structured what i said will drag recruiters to me because like i'm talking about how you 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 you, you how 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 you could use um design thinking to implement it in a business you know so so these are those little things that you know if you pay attention correctly you can get from the program you know so these these are the things that really helped me and i just i was very fast in doing this because I'm an international I came as an international student you know so time is not my friend 
I had to work smart, not work hard to, 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 to get myself in the industry, you know, not just because I, I, I didn't know what I was doing or I had no previous experience, but I mean, moving from a different, I wouldn't say country now, from a different continent, you know, into a new one, having no clue of how business is done here or how, you know, um, the market is, is quite difficult. So this is where Industry Connect stepped in you know, and gave me that um, level playing ground to, you know, get ease of access into the industry. So yeah, it worked well for me. Uh, the course was beautiful. Like um, our tutors were like great. They were perfect. Like, you know, in terms of um, understanding, yeah, I would speak for myself, yeah, because like I would say before this, like I really had like a little bit of knowledge I mean, I did my master's in data analytics, so yeah. obviously I already know what they were talking about, but business intelligence and using Microsoft BI stack is quite different thing completely, especially when you're doing data warehousing, which I found difficult in college. So it was well simplified, like the knowledge, the Brilliant. way everything was being explained, it was done well. The six weeks program in as much as, well, I wouldn't say um, it's short because like, Obviously, this is trying to give you a solid foundation and as an individual, you have to go and do your homework correctly, which is you have to go and research and still grow yourself in that field. You can't, even as a professional, you can't, you can't say you're all knowing. You still have to go to Stack Overflow for some one or two minor things, you know, SQL authority or whatever, like you're looking for when you have glitches or like, you know, errors or bugs or whatever, you know, so, so yeah, the, 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 the training course was perfect. I have no worries. I have no problem. Like it was, it was very seamless and it was enjoyable. Yeah. What I would, what I would say honestly is the, the, um, um, the internship showed me a way of finding answers like you clearly mentioned in the real world the truth is no one has your time i yep. mean at the moment now my boss is always like on a call like almost 24 7. the right. senior business analyst and the developers are busy no one has they just tell you oh this a is equals to b uh figure it out you know so yep. you, it, it's the ability for you to go on your own and I'd use the word transpose or the ability for you to find those answers. Like it's the world wide web. That's that's why it's there. Like you can always find anything. It's just how do you narrow your search? Like how do you filter what you want? You know, mm -hmm. you have it to your head, but it's how you structure what you're looking for, you know, and that is what the internship helped me because like honestly, before this I knew nothing about SQL authority. There were some bugs, like, I mean, even in the videos, like we have recordings of the videos and stuff. And um, um, during the live sessions or the live training where, where where we were like, oh, why is this happening like this? Is it because it's in 32 bits or 64 bits? Now, after like, even before that, when I was trying things on my own, I would run into bugs or run into errors. And I'm like, oh, how am I going to do it? But now the clear ability for you to copy those error codes and search sometimes is yeah. not narrowed enough but when you search and you search and you keep searching you find the answer and then you find the answer it sticks here because i mean this is your hard work you know you put in that effort to find it but if someone just tells you uh click on this and that and this it flies away you know yes. apparently so 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 that's what um the whole internship helped me to do the, the ability then for let's talk about the um the hub i would tell you personally i didn't use it as much because like i, I wouldn't say I, i'm not a team player i am a team player but then like it was more like a lot of people were asking like almost similar questions which i had really like gone online to find you know yeah. so, so that was the reason why Clearly, I didn't um, use it so much, but I mean, the way it's structured is for you to interact with your teammates, with your peers, for you and your teammates to share knowledge, 
you know so many times a lot of people were not using the the um the hub but they were using teams you know hey this is my code uh what do you think is the problem like you know you know so a lot of people were mostly using um not team sorry slack the slack channel uh, yeah to, I said Teams because we're using Teams now, and uh, <laughs> just, so a lot of people were um, using the Slack channels to um, communicate their problems to um, specific individuals to see, oh, can you help me with this or that, you know? But we're not using like um, the hub. But then some people did use, um, you know, the whole platform too. So, but I mean. The output is everyone got to learn, you know, and a lot of people, a lot of people were um, quite lucky enough to understand um, the metrics of things. I'll use that word, and um, they got out quickly, like myself. So yeah, worked well. I mean, everyone sees the output now as success, but behind the scene, I had you know failures. So let, let's yeah. <laughs> Let, let's let's get it straight like i was saying there were so many times where i had rejections like i got rejections from big companies that there was one i was this close to getting and they told me no you don't have a financial background and you hit me hard but i had to go back to the drawing board and i checked and said okay let me go through this process you know mm -hmm. so it, it always comes out rosy you know when eventually you get the job and everyone is like oh my god you did not you know at yeah. some point you know i had to still put in the work you know so yeah so um so um even during those rejections i still had my tax and i was still doing them I, I i had my mentor and i was like in close contact with her and she was like okay um for now just focus on your interviews and getting it straight you know so mm -hmm. yeah um kunal was always there honestly i won't lie to you kunal was always like reaching out to me texting me uh giving me motivational like you know speeches and you know trying to set my mind right yeah you know yeah. but then he understood something about me that even before him saying that i knew like oh there is no giving up here i'd already committed to this and i told myself like um in three months i would get a job yeah. And that's yeah. how I was working and I, I didn't lose focus, I was going at it. So he was always like checking up on me, have you done this, have you done that? Like honestly speaking, I had no, um, how would I put it? I had no like um, a mock interview with anyone because like all I just did was I looked at a template that was given on, um, on the platform on how to structure your CV. I used that, that to structure my CV and I kept you know learning from um it's just like when you're trying to upgrade an application from version one to two to three to four yeah. that's what i was just doing you know changing the versions or upgrading myself okay i didn't do this right i didn't put it right it doesn't sound right like trying to put myself in the recruiter's shoe like okay you said you did this but is there any proof to like you know so this yeah. would work just asking myself questions and going back and forth and eventually I had, uh, I was lucky, I had a three-stage interview with the company and at the first uh, meeting with him, like, I didn't even allow my present boss to talk, I was just going on, going on, going on, going on, you know, at some point he just started telling me my role, he didn't ask me no question anymore, you know, so so that was it, like, he, um, he knew that I understood what he was trying to say, the message, and he's an expert, like, he's Microsoft certified and, you know, but he clearly knew what I was trying to say and I clearly understood what he was trying to say and that was it, you know, so yeah.